And then knock on the coffin lid. Number two. Let's do it. Let's run it back. Right. I would like to pretend the last episode went really, really well for those watching on YouTube potentially, but no. No, we had an hour of misery. Right. Okay. I'm not worrying about you guys. Do I still want to see this bandit? I want to find out what happened to this elven family. I'm going again. Let's do it. Right, that'll help me scale. Mm -hmm. Smack. Uh, I've got nothing else to do. Why not? Okay, here we go. 16 damage incoming. Pretty much sorts it out, I think. I mean, I should just look at the maths first and make sure I've got the kill. And then your damage is irrelevant to me. Not after here, though. Nice. Right, we're going to figure out what's going on with this, this family now. Um, I do like Drain Strength. You know what? Trick being upgraded as well. Just a zero cost, five block draw one. It's pretty good. This is... This is decent, but the problem with it is... We're, we're gambling on the enemy having Strength and Bomb. They tend to have Strength. That That's not a big issue, but the Bomb... Here or there. I think we'll take Trick though. Let's get to this bandit camp. I want to. It must mean this bandit camp, right? Maybe there's more. No, you're an elven camp. You're not a bandit camp. Can we see any more bandit camps? Not seeing any immediately. It must mean this place. I've just not figured out where we have to talk yet to find out what happened to that family. Um. There's no point laying you out again. I have to give my gear, but I do get free upgrades. Let's try the gamblers. I went up to the gamblers and started watching. The game looked pretty honest, and I had a thought of joining it. I'm not quite sure how to help you with that. Shut up, Alexa. Mind of your own. Right. Okay, let's play. What? What? That's rubbish. It must not mean that bandit camp. Unless I, maybe I need to sit by the fire. Let's pivot. Go a different route from last time. Right, okay. Call the wild. Get it out there. Smack. Smack. Please. Don't need to play that, that block. He tried. So far, so good. Maneuver, burn, gain one energy. Exterminate, deal nine damage if the enemy is exposed. It's okay, but we've not got we've not got exposed. I'll take a manoeuvre. Could be interesting. Now what we've got here. War is a filthy affair with corpses piling up and marauders descending like vultures. Rifling through the dead and preying on the living. I came across one such piece of scum along the way. He lacked the capacity to even be embarrassed. On the contrary, he beckoned me over and asked me to help him pull the boots off a corpse. Absolutely. Buy random gear. Is that still an option to me? Let me get some gold first, mate, and we'll talk about your gear. Mm. We talked a bit about looting business. There are a lot of broken weapons and damaged armor on the battlefield. It's not easy to find something worthwhile. I mean, we haven't got anything. I know it's all going to be trash. I'll just take a helmet. Let's see what you've got. What? 
Okay. I'm game. Right, what we have in the poor troll or the troll? <laughs> the poor troll or the normal troll? A sad troll with a sword in his back pleading for help. A peace loving troll dislikes war very much. Ah, let's go with the sword in the back. <laughs> Refused to bud, the troll lost himself in pain and fury, attacked me in a rift fit of rage. Sure we'd pulled it out before, right? Oh damn. Okay. Trolls are the most innocent victims of war. But you hardly think about that when one of these monsters is coming. Didn't need to use the new bother. I don't think we're gonna need it for anything else at this point right now. What you got here? Fury deals double damage. Okay. Can live with that. 30 though, I'm not sure I want to live with that. It's going to be more, right? It'll be 45 damage incoming if I do nothing about it. Still not going to be very nice, but... I weren't, I weren't the, the worst, to be fair. I would have helped you, bro. Correct. Right, gain eight block, deal six damage. Active defense. It's not bad. It's not great. It's not bad. Ultimatum burn, gain one strength, one agility, and draw one. What's my ultimatum? Wait, you're just you're no. There's no negative there. It's just good, right? You're just good. Zero cost, sharp sword. What are you doing to me? What sword have I got equipped? Somewhere else, rubbish, probably. Uh, yeah, you're just better in that you get the deal eight damage two times to all enemies for one cost. That's actually really good. Then, got a couple of options, haven't we? But nice to actually hit a shop. Maybe we aim for the shop. As we're going this way, makes sense to me. Right, let's open this chest, see what's happening. So good. Dollar for the... Two-piece robbers set, you say? Gain 10 gold upon dealing, da dealing health damage with an attack once per turn. It's good for income. Robber's armor. Gain evasion. I don't care about this. Returns all burn cards to the discard. It's not that exciting, but... Is the weapon really what we're after here? I think you got to give it a go, right? This is, this is nice. This is not. It's the only way I can see that. Weird to have free weapons when I need armor and stuff, but I mean, I'll take it. Hopefully, it'll help us build up some gold. I should put it on for now as well, just in case we run into trouble. Could actually get rid of you, but we do lose 10 HP from not having that shield. Time after time, I find that it's impossible to notice an elven scout hiding in the night forest. They are real shadow warriors. To avoid this encounter, I'll have to choose another road. The scout had tracked down the Dwarven General, but he didn't dare to attack alone. Instead, he found me and asked for help. Okay. You got a deal, bro. Uh, can I back out? Guys. Guys, can I back out? Can't play two attacks in a row here. 
They all get Fiori right. Mm -hmm. This is going to be tough for us. But we could end up with quite a bit of gold if we do survive. Survive is, is going to be difficult though. This is no messing around on hardcore. I mean, sure. Okay. Still don't need to play maneuver though. Well, no, it doesn't matter, does it? If I play this, I can only play one anyway. I've, I've got a hit. It's non-negotiable, really. Just don't play two attacks in a row. Or two of anything in a row. You know what? Well, I can't do that, really. Okay. Hopefully they hit the guy at the back. Nope. Of course they go for me. It seems like the AI's changed in that regard. I'm sure before they used to prioritize your followers. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I've got lucky before. Now this is a little bit scary because I need to play two attack. Well, I need to play like, three attacks. It's only you that's going to get Fiora. I've got to play that. I'll take the gold. Now the problem is I can I can hit you with these and do 13 damage, but that's going to be 20 damage incoming then. And you're probably hitting me. Which I don't like. But I don't like not attacking when I can attack. Okay. Did go for the back guy though. When I don't play my cards, you go for the back guy. I wish I'd know. It'd be nice if I knew who you were targeting. Doesn't seem to be a possibility. Okay. Got a game down though now. It's looking okay. <laughs> nice cleansing blow. Deal seven damage. Burn one status card in the draw pile. It's okay. Demoralize. I think it's a skip though for us. Trap. No. Don't think so. It's just a bit too expensive. For what it does. Oh, now you're throwing Elvin at me. Right, fair enough. I love Elvin Dance's move. No. Game one evasion, game two ward. Ideally, I'd prefer the sword, but I'm not. I'm not taking four swords when I need other gear. Give me the boots. Okay, we get the shop. Okay, we found some. It. We found some. It. We got the robber's buckler as well. At the beginning of the turn, you have more money than block. Block does not disappear. That sounds good. But no, we what we gotta buy this. It's non-negotiable, right? We have to, it's too good. Right, this crap can get sold. Sold. Thank you for your hard work. Just wondering, actually. Could have two weapons on. Lose 10 max health, but you, you're you going to give me 30 anyway. It's a lot of dollar. I mean, I could sell you. I'm just, just wondering if I can equip both. 
Is that greedy? It's definitely greedy. The only issue I have is that we're going to have a lot of attacks in our draw pile. Defending's not going to be that easy. Nah, I'll sell you now. You've done, you've done work for us. I appreciate it. Do we want a potion route? I think we're good. Not going to worry. Right. Let's get out of this area now. Three piece elven set. Restore five elf for each evasion. Beautiful. Okay. Now give us upgrades. We could have done with a rest as well, to be fair. It's probably a little bit too quick on me throwing that in there. Um, it's a good upgrade. The problem is it's a one use card. So the upgrade's only good for one turn. So I do think we probably need a better target for that. And we need to scale. We need a little bit of scaling because our damage output is a little bit weak right now. I'm a little bit worried about this boss with our health. But you have to take our core as it comes, right? Let's go. Right, four evasion to fight without a squire. Hmm? What are you on about? Squire bullshit. Let's just smack. He can't defend forever. Get the evasion. You have got evasion there as well. Uh, you may as well take it. No reason not to. A breather never hurt anybody. Did want to upgrade trick as well, actually. But was that? What's the card that we we got? It's not from a card in our deck or an item in our deck. Sorry. Just keep scaling. Beijing is king. Why avoid damage? Or why? Why take damage if you can avoid it? go through you, draw one and have a, have a look, but no, okay, don't need the block, I mean, if I can just draw that elven dance every turn, it's pretty good, shame you can't upgrade some of these, Obviously a little bit more tricky when you're attacking three or four times, but... Oh, where's my attacks? Just when I need my attacks. What are you doing, you fool? Maybe I get you out first. Right now, we're fine. I could have aimed for you, but you're, you're going to keep stacking up that and you're going to make it even better for us. So, I do think the play is to just get rid of you. Now that's strength. Inglorious death. Okay. I mean, we still not got a worry. This is why we need a short deck or a thin deck. Doesn't matter. Evasion's too strong in this game. you counter it with it's 
62. That's big. Damn, you missed. You missed, you fool. Nice. Okay, there we go. He's out of there. Accumulated force. Plane lunges increases damage by six for the first lunge plate in the next turn. Um, I was reading that and I was getting excited. It looks cool. The art looked good. And I'm like, okay. Right. I'm expecting like a blade dance. Overdrive. Right, the start of the turn. Gain strength. Now you're talking language though. Oh, you want both of these. It's only on like one lunge. Like, increase it. Be accurate. Be like, increase your lunges by four. Let's go battle lust. Well, what we got here. First look at the amulets. Gain energy at stop turn. Gain one strength and lose one agility. I don't know if that's permanent scaling agility, like, because it sounds like you're just going to keep stacking strength and losing agility. Over the long fight, that, I mean, could swing either way, right? Bone spear. No, we can't. We can't have a weapon. We can't have the armor. We have to take this, right? I need the energy. It's just not really the one I want. I don't like losing agility. But you know what? At the same time, the evasion means we don't really care about agility. But now this one is really good. You don't get we don't get the energy from it, but we get upgrades from it. I think we take it. Uh, I'll take tirelessness. Let's do this. Come on. Progress. I knew we had it in us. Right, okay. We still have events to hit here, but we need to get here for apparent story progression. So, what's a route where we can hit loads of question marks? I see two. I'm not seeing any more than that, though. Right, I see two. So you might as well try and hit a sh well, do we want a shot? Yeah, I guess you do. Right, okay, let's go. Uh, not what you're after here. It's a bit better. So you know what? Let's just play that, get it out of our deck. Could, I could reduce the cost of that, but... Nah. Mm -hmm. I love the subtle effects you see around the character. I like the, the spinning wind, which I think represents my evasion, right? It's really cool. Like the little details on the characters, in my opinion. Can't get rid of these. I'll just keep hitting. I don't even need to play that. Ooh. Wait a minute. Oh, you're the medal. We do get we get both of these on. Nice so far, so good. Uh what is that shit? Mm -hmm. I don't want these shitty status cards. Okay, Emridge needs to go. We'll take the evasion there. Just smack. Okay. Or not, here I come. You can't hide. Love it. Scaling blocks as well. Lightning strike. Do free damage. Gain a copy in the discard pile. Draw one. Dance of death is good, but again, we we just not really that interested in the agility right now. But with scaling strength, and you do attack twice, it's, it's pretty good. I'm not a fan.
You were one cast deal damage draw, but I just just don't see it. Gain a copy. You, you just end up with a ton of these in playing them, but you still need a bit of energy to make it work. Could take the dance of death. I just. I mean, how great is it ultimately? I just think it's a skip. Right where we at. The might. The divine might. Okay. You want to learn more about it from us? Okay, here we go. That doesn't make sense to me. How did you rip through loads of my evasion? What was you on? Um. We're absolutely fine. Let's just start getting that strength building up, I think. That needs to go. That needs to be played. You may as well. I mean, yeah, I can't do much else there. I didn't draw any attacks. Load of shit. Right, go. What's being burned here? Makes sense. I need to be careful now. They're putting blight on me. Where's my elven dance? Let's take that arm off. Right, our evasion's gone. The mites are ripping through my evasion. Right, you're dead. Nice. Having four energy with two elven dances. It's important. That's what's happening. Look, nine times six. I mean, we ain't got to worry about it too much, but it's not very nice. Zero mm -hmm. block on that, but it's just not worth playing it for four block, right? Well, I guess it was, to be fair. Would have blocked one. Well, we've got no elven dance. We just lunge here. We've got big damage. We accept his damage incoming. Wait, oh no, we got evasion from you attacking. Let's get you gone. Quick. Wait, wait, wait. This could be like the end of his. It's not quite enough, is it? Because. Um, it's a bit tricky now. We actually need to gamble. <laughs> we got it. Okay. We had to make sure that, that he went down then. I don't think we'd have survived his attacks. Uh, no. Drawing a curse or status, draw one more. It, it is pretty good, to be fair, because there's a lot of bosses that stick or stack you up with that kind of crap. But I am going to skip. You're just expensive, I think. Too expensive for what you do. We have got another card that just gives us block, right? Armor. Like, I guess, in that regards, you're just a, a better version of you. But, not going to worry. Orcs boots, no thank you. I mean... You take the shield, but you lose, you lose the extra HP. I don't really want any of this. I'll just take you. No, I don't equip it. What are you again? Health damage now. We keep the medal. Right, we're getting upgrade. Let's get you going. It's good good scaling for us. We need that. Uh more evasion, sure. Right, we need a good shot. More elven. 
Show me the elven stuff, bro. My man's a dickhead. You got all the defiled crap in the world, though. Guess it serves me for, to come in for you for a bit of support. Is there anything I want to get rid of? Like, we could actually just remove a guard with our evasion. Just don't know if it's the right play. We don't have amazing defense. We have evasion. But if we're coming up against enemies, they're attacking like six or seven silly times. You know what? We do it. Let's get rid of her shitty block here. Yeah, I'm going to have to leave, mate. You've got nothing else here, unfortunately. I have got a health potion. I'll buy another, actually. It's fine. Let's leave. Should be able to use my potions from here, right? Just take that now. And we'll hold on to the other. Question mark. Ooh. I went to a well to get some water, but the stench coming from it was so foul that I changed my mind. Suddenly, a shout came up from the well. Help me out of here. I shuddered. The voice was unexpected, distorted, and scary. I only looked. I looked into the well to see the unfortunate prisoner and face something horrible. <laughs> horrible? Really? Not oh, after a drink. Um. Let's just get you scaling now. You've acquired a taste for buffs. One damage. All damage taken reduced to one. When the effect is removed, change the intention to escape. Right. So how do we... Mark of death. Reduces by one at the end of the turn. When the counter reaches zero, kills the mark bearer. What? Wait, I've got to hit you 83 times then. That doesn't make sense. What? I need to remove that. Right, I need you to escape. Just get out of here. Leave me alone. Uh, can I run? Remove the targets in substantiality. So yeah, I can remove it. Problem is, can't kill you, can I? Not with that hand. I want to kill you if I can. Now the problem is, I don't know what your intentions might be after this, and I might not get another highlight. It doesn't say it burns. It's a bit of a risk. But what are the chances though? This is the problem we have. We're, we're not going to... It's so unlikely that we're going to... Well, not unlikely, but we need to draw like four attacks. Okay. Can't kill you right now. So let's just hit... <laughs> Let's hope we get another one, or we get it back. If we have to let her escape, we'll let her escape. I'd like to try and kill her. Oh, we've not got another there. Which should still be in our discard. Okay. So we can flourish as well, which is going to help us get the scaling. So let's just try and knock you down a tiny bit. Eight turns. Right. Creases again. Keep hitting. Okay. 24 strength. Six turns left. We get the highlight, but only two attacks. But it's eight. It's got it. We got it. We got it. Easy. Nice. 
Okay, ultimatum again. Lightning strike. I just, again, I don't see the use. Like, yeah, you get draw. You could have loads of these in your deck, but... We'd need more more than draw than that. Just them on their own, I think. But I think you can always take an ultimatum here. Right, so, wait, I want to know what happened with the well. I, I, I should have saved him, right? Did I not end his torment? No? Alright, we'll come back in another life, bro. Who knows? Mystery. Um, no, no, no. Take it. Right. What was here again? Because I can't remember. The Ron Bog is inhabit inhabited not only by the cultists, but also by other motley crowd hiding from prying eyes in the swampy wilderness. This time I met a servant of death who had somehow got hold of a rare artifact, a crimson spear. He wanted to awaken its hidden power and offered... Let me, let me read up. And offered me to participate in the ritual. A doubtful offer given the circumstances. I wonder what he's doing in the rotten box. Should I have asked? Uh, no, it's useless. Ooh. Sum up with this guy in the cursed sword from Act 1. Do I really want to do this? It's just gonna, he's, he's going to curse me. If it's related to this, it's got to be a curse. But... Mm -hmm. Okay, my doubts were confirmed. I had to cut myself with a magic spear and let it drink my blood. The more blood was spilled, the higher the chances were of awakening the hidden powers of the artifact. I, mean, I don't necessarily want a spear, do I? Why, why would I bleed? Do I need to bleed? <laughs> the got a little out of hand. I didn't know for sure if the power of the spear had awakened or not, but I took it with me just in case. Desecrated bloody spear. Ah, oh, you're defiled. I knew it! I knew it! You put a load of crap in my deck. You don't... So, you're not cursed, though. So, have I got them in my deck? <sighs> that's... That's gonna ruin us a little bit. That's not good news. Okay. Okay. Curses, man. Can't even get rid of them without selling them, so we need to get a shot. Bloody spear. Nice. 
Draining lunge. Delayed damage of target as weakness. Steal one strength from it. Drawing a curse. A status draw one more. This is this is good for us now. All right, I'll take it. Terrible predatory creatures rove amidst the swamps. They have no place in our world. These are all products of the so-called divine might. Might? I feel those creatures emanating a demonic presence, but it's nothing like the demons I fought of old. I know not the nature of this entity. It could have been born out of some primordial spirit's insanity, but it might also be of demonic origin. Where it dwells or what it looks like is not known. It must be some enormous half-intelligent beast lurking in the murky depths of the bog. So you say it's hiding. I can't say I feel at all like finding it. Okay, we need to come back to you then. You didn't give me the option to ask yet. We don't need a heal, we'll go for the train. Um, let's get you upgraded. Come on then, Mike Queen. Let's do this. You've acquired a taste for bugs. Mm -hmm. Okay. Where did this one come from? Off the bitch. Mm -hmm. Sure, just smack. Oh, look at how many attacks are coming in. We're gonna start taking damage. Ten blight on us already. And that's how he died. Okay. Might need to use the uh, the evasion potion here. Hello. Oh, what is this? We do not buy followers here. You can go. It's fine. Can't play any of that. Fly, you fools. What? to go. You can mm -hmm. play for free. Just want to smack you. No! Right, let's pop this. Did the enemy just stand there and watch while you drank it? Should have. Should have definitely attacked you first. Block it all, or we evade it all anyway. Hmm. Right, we'll take you. Smack. Smack. No. Fine. Going to get us right. Nah, we got the damage now. Mm -hmm. Um, just do what you need to do. 
we attack you though? Half damage. Half is all I need. Ethereal armor, ethereal gain 10 block and 1. Insubstantiality. If it's down to a 2 cost, insubstantiality means you don't take damage, but unless I can hold you in my hand and guarantee when I need you, I don't think. Don't think it's worth it. No, I'm gonna skip. These just don't feel exciting to me. This could be really good, but it's situational unless I can pull it when I need it. Fox hat. Do we still have? I mean, gain two armor and two strength is always good. What's our amulet again? Gain one strength and lose agility. On enemy's death each turn, gain one energy and draw one extra card. Gain two evasion. When evasion is triggered, restore 10 health and burn one status card in the draw pile. We want you. Um, We'll just take the draw two cards of our choice. Mike Queen's hair. At the start of the turn, put some random card from the discard pile into hand. No, we keep you. Give me an upgrade. Something worthwhile here. It's not really anything. Get another one scaling, right? I'd like a draw one, though. Let's take a draw, because I think it's going to upgrade them with the medal, and I think it's going to upgrade them with the first option. It's obvious to me that the world is descending into an abyss. Why didn't you tell me about this from the start? Though I probably wouldn't have believed you. Do you need me to say more? Do you really have a plan to fix this mess? If I'm already a part of this plan, I demand to know more. No, we all should have plans of our own. You can only trust someone who pursues their own goals. Okay, where we're at. We've got a few options now. So you want me to come here, but I can't actually start there from this from this end at least. This is a blacksmith. We need gold to pay you unless we want to fight you. I need to come in the front entrance regardless. Start at this question mark. A demon messenger approached me. He looked like an ordinary human and I almost believed him crazy when he offered me demonic power in exchange for an oath of fealty. He assured me that his masters were generous and the oath was a mere trifling formality. <laughs> what am I doing? What am I doing here? Oh, he's made to the demons are binding. Laughing merrily, he jeered. So easily bought. Now take your gifts and we'll be seeing you. This is some kind of nonsense. What do you mean? Is that it? I assure you, you wouldn't want to make a real oath of fealty to the demons. Ow. Ow. Get a cursed item. Do we have a shop or anything coming up? I don't think you do on the right. Hmm. Not unless we uh, pivot to this side, which is not happening. I don't want. Unless you improve abilities.
No! Stop it! Why do I do it to myself? I just want to experiment with the events, guys! We may as well go full curse now. We've never actually destroyed it. We don't need that now. Nah, let's let's destroy it. Let's see if we can. A creepy inquiline generated by someone's misfortune. <laughs> Okay. Okay, even with all this crap in our deck. It's got big damage though. Okay, at the moment. Brimming over with power. How many more are there? I want to get rid of you. I don't like you. Leave it. Okay, we're okay. Elven dance. Okay, we're getting there. So good. Upon taking health damage, gain strength. I'll take it. You're not an elven. Actually, at the start of the turn, lose one strength. No. Demonic axe. Every turn, strength is increased or decreased. Sounds scary. I'll take you. Um, might need that. Blue fire. Gain two energy, taking damage. Adds a slowdown card to the draw pile. I'll keep you. Alright, give me that upgrade for the cost of one. That's big. What we got? Whatever. Right, what new items have we got? Because we got you. Did we want you on instead of you? Gain two armor and two strength. Now, are these status cards? Because I think they're curses. They don't actually count as status. Don't think that's how it works. I think you're more important to us. Don't need anything else. It's a shame I can't get to a shop to sell. Got a bit of dollar, but what can you do? Might pay this guy off. Haggle with... Nah, he doesn't work for haggling. He asks you for more. 
Unless there's something I'm missing there. Okay, we get to this event here. Any damage incoming. Just get out of my deck. Some big healing though, right? Rest in peace. Don't need that that energy for defend on this turn. This ain't gonna be enough to get through Melenis. I have no idea how I managed to do it twice with Fanadis. Right, you get out of there. We can take Strategist. Uh, okay. What was my upgrade? Aliens invaded the Northern Gate. The Brotherhood of Fire, a paramilitary order in tolerance of all manifestations of evil spirits, undead demons, and any dark cults. They came to purify this land of filth. But instead of immediately taking the palace by storm, they staged a real massacre on the outskirts, destroying entire villages along with all the inhabitants. Shit happens, Unfortunately, bro. according to their dogmas, they have no choice but to burn down everyone and everything. The corruption is too deeply rooted in the possessions of Sigismund. Let's get him. Right, let's see what this event is. The Royal Forge wasn't empty. A demonic blacksmith had settled in it. I was taken back when I recognized him as the old court blacksmith. Although there was little left of his old look, however, he seemed happy to meet me and even offered me his services. Create me something special? The blacksmith can make something special for me if I bring him a legendary item. Golem core, I can craft you armor. In that armor, you'll be completely invincible, but, but not forever. So we need to kill the golem, but we need the password for the golem. We don't know the password yet. We don't know how to find that yet. We're going to have to find it at some point. I know where to find the golem, but I don't know how to kill it. Then find that out. Yeah. We know where the golem is. We just don't know the password. Right, what do we want you to reforge? Um, none of my good stuff. Do we have any good items worth? So you don't actually tell me... Well, you know what? Mate, reforge that. 
get rid of some defiled crap. I'll take it. Might have thinned down my deck, but exploring the world, you need to find a way to kill the golem in order to obtain the energy core for the armor of invincibility. Right, okay, yeah, fair enough. Just don't know where that is yet. Okay. We don't really need the rest. Let's train. Just nice additional draw there for us. My journey came to an end, but I had never found a way to counter Melenis. So what did you decide to do? What? Why would you want me to end? I decided to practice killing Sigismund. Oh, I can end it there. Nah, you gotta go for the boss, right? You'd really want me to leave it there? Come on then, bro. We're not gonna kill Melanis, but we might get Sigismund done. With a better look. Your okay, here we go. Coming to an end. I can come <laughs> out, get that scaling up straight away. Uh, I don't necessarily need this draw. We need to start scaling, I think. Oh, we've got the evasion. Is there anything we want to play for zero here? We could draw two cards. You know what? I think we do. We'll take you. We'll take Grudge. Alright, see what you can do there. Immune for one turn. We don't really need that. Okay, let's see what they can do. Never hurt anybody. Needs to go. Let's make us in. They need to go. That needs to go. Not a great turn for us. Your hands are getting weak. They can no longer hold the weapon. Mm -hmm. Now that's string. <laughs> Why are you two uh, four cards? Okay. Keep scaling that block, it might come in handy if we lose evasion. So we've got keep increasing it. Only to hope for a miracle. Big damage incoming. It's fine by me. Let's just take these elves. A flick to the nose. What's up? We banned. Okay, you've about gone through all me evasion, so I need to be careful now. I want to stack it. Gain, yeah, gain, gained another evasion from him attacking. We're okay. Let's just see what we've got here. Just want to keep playing you. Do you burn stuff from my deck? These need to 
go. But I need to hit. This doesn't do anything really. Okay. We should gate. Well, we've got the base there then. Take that one. Okay, we're taking damage. Muddled, I don't want muddled. We're gonna be taking damage here though. I feel like I've gotta get rid of you. You need to go. Careful, he's contagious. Are you just dead here? We've got one evasion. That's okay, an interesting yeah. reaction to your blows. Kind of what I expected. So I better do that. We've got blight as well. We've got a lot of debuffs on us. See what you want to give me here. You need to go. Um, not that evasion. Not got another evasion. Prickly bastard. Or at least we've uh, changed your intention. Ah! Oh, did you have barbed or something? I should have looked as you changed. Ah, either way, you know, we wouldn't have killed Melenis. But we've made progress in the story to potentially be able to kill her. Does 15 damage if kills, gain free energy, draw free and gain free strength. Okay, they sound decent. Nice, okay. I'm not going to consider that one a lose. Not, not great, but we got to the boss. We just need to find the golem, the password for the golem, or a way to kill the golem. I'm not sure how that's possible right now. But anyway, I'll leave that there. If you enjoy Knock on the Coffin Lid, guys, please consider liking, subscribing, and following. You know the drill. I appreciate any support you can give. It means a lot. Anyway, we're going to leave Knock on the Coffin Lid there now.